Welcome to the January edition of Inside the NCAA. I'm Hannah Meister. More than 3,500 people attended the NCAA convention in San Antonio, where delegates from each division took part in educational sessions, governance meetings, and awards events. Division I made news early in the week by loosening rules for men's basketball players who hoped to participate in the NBA draft. This new flexibility with pro leagues continued as the autonomy group adopted a new rule allowing drafted high school baseball players to use an agent for contract negotiations. But any such relationship must be severed if the student enrolls to play in Division I. The autonomy group also had a robust conversation around time demands of student athletes. These discussions and votes prompted the need for more consideration of proposals that will now be voted on at the 2017 convention. The group did pass an important measure that will give medical personnel the final say on when a concussed or injured student athlete can return to play. Division II approved six proposals, including one that requires national certification of strength and conditioning coaches, and another that requires student athletes to be academically and athletically eligible in order to compete unattached and outside competition. Additionally, the division declined to remove equestrian from the list of emerging sports. Division III voted to raise annual membership dues from $900 to $2,000 per school, and from $450 to $1,000 for conferences. And after a lengthy debate, Division III members defeated a proposal to allow contact during spring football. Former Secretary of State Condoleezza Rice gave an impactful keynote speech. She focused on the importance of college sports being an avenue to education for athletes. Rice was also presented with the Gerald R. Ford Award during the event. President Emmert's State of the Association speech outlined three NCAA priorities for the upcoming year, academics, fairness, and the well-being of student athletes. The final event, the Honors Celebration, featured inspiring stories of strength, courage, and success. Dikembe Mutombo, Lauren Hill, and Peter Uberoth are just a few of the outstanding people we celebrated. You can find the full list of honorees, along with more information from convention, on NCAA.org. Thanks for watching.